done. We're like, huh. okay, so this time it was like I was chilling out and I was like, hey, what time is it? And I just happened to glance. I'm over here texting people and talking to people. Meanwhile, I'm like literally had two minutes. So my bad, y'all. Oh, wait. There is light. Okay, so um, oh, yeah, you had an accident. Then come back in now. Oh, did it, oh, did you fix no. it? Oh, yeah, man, for oh, a little bit. How, how, how? It just it has a mind of its own. <laughs> yeah, I'll get it. I got it. Just let me do it. One. Okay, y'all. So I felt like I want to try to do stuff as much as hi, JC. I want to try hey, to Chase. have stuff as much done Felipe. here. Uh, Felipe. So, um, hey Kelly, hey Nosy. I don't want to, I mean, I want to have things so that you guys can see, but I felt like the last time I did the, um, I felt like the last time I had the, there's a ball on here if you want to. Yeah. I felt like the last time I did the smothered pork chops, I had the papas already, the potatoes already. Hey Liz, already done. And I just want to, I'm trying to do as much of the stuff with y'all so you guys can get like, do I have 25 minutes? Cause that's how long it's going to take. Or do I have 30 minutes? Cause that's how long it's going to take. So I, hey, I, Lee. I, the only thing I prepped this time was I washed the potatoes, but I'm going to do everything in there. So that way you guys can get, Hey Marissa, you guys can get a, a real, um, a real and honest sense, sense of how much time <laughs> you know, I'm going to punch him. <laughs> okay, so today we're making Salisbury steak. My version is also transferable into in the slow cooker. What I would do if I was going to do it in the slow cooker is I would give it a toast, throw it in the slow cooker, grab a toast, throw it in the slow cooker. Then you stick your slow cooker on warm and you empty your, uh, you put slice up an onion, throw it in between so, like, say you have four pieces of meat. So, you yeah. put meat, meat, onions, and then you get a can of cream of mushrooms and pour it. Then you get meat, meat, you know, raw or just only, it's just got a brown on it. And then you do another layer of onions. And then you do another can of cream, cream of a mushroom soup. It's the easiest thing. I actually kind of invented it um, when I, somebody was saying something about their, and these are the kind that we're using, you guys. The cutlets or whatever, what are they called? Yeah, they look like they've been uh, through a machine. Cube steak. Cube steak. Yeah. They're, they're like, uh, like a chunk of beef, beef cube steaks, blade tenderized. So anyways, it's been pre-tenderized, so it doesn't need to sit for the seven hours. Yeah, they so put then, it through a machine. So, so then I said, I'm going to make a new version. And so I started making a new version and it came out just fine. Um, if you guys don't have that long, um, I'm doing it in like kind of like a one pot kind of thing. Um, but I'm going to show you how it's done. I have my brand new. Y'all, look at my pan. Okay, ask me how many times I've used this. Watch your thing. Oh, shit. Ask me how many times I've used my pan. Because I've used it for papas. Hey, Southern girl. I've used it for. Says, hey, man. I made an egg in it. I made papas in it. And there's a patty called a uh, potato egg patty. What When you have leftover mashed potatoes. I think your mom's in You, there. like, uh, blend an egg. Like, mix it up. And then you get your mashed potatoes from the night before. And you fold it in there and incorporate it. And then you put oil in a pan. How many times? How many? How many times? What are you? Uh, I've used it like five times and we got it sun Saturday, yeah, Monday. Yeah, yeah. I, I re-seasoned them. Yep. I, I used it like lot. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I use it every day, even if I'm just like making an egg. So I have waited my whole life for it. I've been <laughs> so envious. We go to Bucky's, I go through the little aisle or whatever and i'm madison like madison ever look at oh maddie came in Hello, um madison so Averill. i walk through the little aisle at bucky's and i'm like oh my god i want this so bad and and they're really not terribly expensive they just just it just depends on what things what we're able to do and, and if i can't then i just walk by and i'm like i'll come i swear to you, i go up to him and i'm like i'll be back for you again one day come on over babe <laughs> who's <right>. this guy <laughs> <laughs> that's joe anyways so here, we're gonna, um, two things you guys to learn about your pan. Never gonna wash it. They sell a little tool if you ever have a cast iron. You never- You do wash it, you just use water. A after you season it, you don't use soap. What you use is like a chain, it looks like a place- a, um, Chain mail. A, a, yeah, it's like a pot holder made out of all chain. And so what you do is basically get it and you're gonna basically scrub the stuff out of it. Watch, watch grab but, it. But um, this thing right here, um, we'll get hotter than I don't know what. what? So we ordered some what of those. What oh. <laughs> okay. thing? This thing right here. That thing. So, but the, it is going to get hot, you guys. But I read 
and just certain, I prepared myself for this cast iron. Excuse me. <laughs> you don't put your meat or anything into it till it's at least been on the fire for about two to three minutes. You want it hot versus just um, a lukewarm or cold one, putting it on there. So, but it, I tell you what, it's the best nonstick ever. Best ever. nonstick ever. ever. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. Uh, that's you can put a, some um, water in there if you don't mind. This? Here? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What was I going to do right now? I, Grab a I, fork. I okay, guys, we are ready. So that was the thing I was going to tell you about the cast iron. Make sure your pan's hot and make sure you never put your Dawn soap in it or anything. I didn't want to even season it. I literally wanted to do everything. I just put uh, per, a little bit in there. Uh, with you guys. I want, I really... When people ask me, like, oh, what's what's the niche about your your channel or what kind of meals? And I'm just like, oh, it's just kind of Mexican food and Southern food and, like, it just has its own things. Um, hey, Mom. Um, but I also want to, I want to, and we didn't even realize it, you guys. Somebody said, most of your meals are all about 30 minutes. And I'm like, really? And um, I think it was Tragic or Gypsy, uh, Gypsy Girl. One of them said, I heard you make 30 minutes. And I'm like. I don't want to hold, don't hold me to 30 minutes, y'all, because it might be like 35 or we try to get it to. I just know that people have things they got to do and they don't want to be stuck in the, in the kitchen all night. So I got it on uh, medium real time. Yes, real time. So real I'm time. putting salt, pepper, and garlic powder, onion powder. I'm going to also put onion in it, but I'm not going to put onion to the end because I don't want them to burn. Yeah, it's getting hot, baby. Yeah, I already put a little, honey. I know it's getting hot. Um, I don't want it to get, I don't want my, my onion pieces to get, um, I don't want my onion pieces to get burnt. And not only because of the pan, but in general, if you cook with your onions throughout the whole meal, it more than likely, they'll get a little bit more bitter and bitter. So I, um, is Drew in here? Or Chasey? Chasey. Um, so F I, Felipe. Felipe. So I season both sides of this. Oh, that's the least both sides. And I just have salt, pepper, garlic powder. All right, what time is it? Chase Quintero Joe. Who's Joe? You little, you little shite. Who's Joe? Are you, uh, do you need this like any place? Um, yeah, over there. Damn, I always do that. There we go. And then once you, if you season it, put the season side down, and then you can season the back end of it. If your, you know, space is limited. Um, I'm gonna put it there. And you guys, just um, especially with stuff like this, when you're gonna do like a a seasoning of what you like. Do you, if you are not a fan of the onions that I'm putting in, don't even put them in. Just use your cream of mushroom soup. If you don't, I, I mean, you, if I had mushrooms, I probably would have sliced up mushrooms and they would have gone in on the, the salisbury. Joe, you want to start the baked yeah. potato? Yep, I'm going to move out of the way. Who don't show? Uh-oh, 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 okay, here, go ahead. And I'll get your flat off. All right. Not quite yet. Oh, there we go. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to do uh, quick baked potatoes. Here, let me uh, see if we can get you smaller right here so you can see me for a moment. We're going to do... Uh, Quick baked potatoes. We're gonna do them in the microwave. And what you do? What, what I do? You can take a fork and do the same thing. But take a knife. What? Our hero's shirt was. Oh open. my goodness! No, it's no, okay. no. It's okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> so you take your knife, and if you're gonna do it in the microwave, basically I do it on the table. I'll show you. Like I said, you can do it with a fork, but this pierces through completely all the way to the bottom. And I'll just do the sides, and then I'll do the bottoms a little bit, and then the other side, and then uh, you're ready to go. I got one potato that I did not do. Those are all done, but uh, I just 
Just be careful. Sharp side away from you. And then side, side, side. Bottom, not so deep, don't have to, because you did all, all the way through on the top side. And do the other side, and you're good to go. And then what we do is we'll take these taters, and then we'll uh, rub oil, like uh, salt. oil over them, and yep. then we'll put salt all over them, put them in the microwave for five minutes on high or whatever, and then uh, you check them after five minutes. It usually takes another four minutes after that, but um, we'll get to it. Because right. uh, we're trying to get them done together, y'all. Yeah, yeah. We're trying to make sure that they're all done at the same time or roughly thereabouts. So let me get a paper towel. But I'm, I'm going to just use my hands and just Lattering. go for it. And they're already been washed. So take them. Get them all oiled up. We got, we got to show you how to make corn on the cob. A little bit. We found, and I'm sure people have seen it online. Oh, there goes, there goes the light. We only have words for a little We while. found out that you can do corn on the cob in the microwave with the husk on it. Oh, yeah. And then you squeeze it. It's like four, it, min it, four minutes uh, for each cob that you put in yeah. there. Yeah, you squeeze it and it protrudes out. And it takes all the, the silk off of it. Yep, you never have to do one silk in it's your house. It's pretty cool. It's a cool trick. So, all right, we got all these oiled up, and then we're gonna just uh, put salt all over them. Then I'm gonna, gonna put them on this little napkin here, put the salt on. All right, so, and just load them up with the salt, no big deal. If you don't, if, if we had the kosher salt, the bigger spray, yeah, we'd use that. ideally that's what we would want. But it'll work, it does the job. And it does, Tastes like if anybody's had red lobster baked potatoes, that's how they do it. They rub Crisco on it though. They don't rub uh, oil. We just, I've made too many tortillas. No, I'm just kidding. Let <laughs> 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 me read the thing. So All right. Oh, yeah, read some stuff. I'm working. Oh, I'm working. Please. You got to read. Please. Hey, Green Falls. Hey, this, this is two, two people for, you know. JC Marissa, Melzi. Hello, guys. Right. Oh, my look, my son's Here in y'all and the baby. No. My beautiful. Let me see. It. Oh, oh, no, we can't no. see him. He just said. All right. Hey, all. Grandbaby and I are checking in. Cut it out. Awesome. Tell me what hey, I love you. Hey, Drew. Hey, Papas. Mom, we has got uh, my baby. All right. Oh, hey, we don't girl. need this on anymore, do we? My husband is a little bit of a hottie. All right. Stop that noise. All right, now oh, we're yeah, just gonna, my this is my plate, is that, is that plate for me? Yeah, baby, that's for you. Just close the door, that was just <laughs> Yeah, that's for you too. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna pop these in on a plate. Put it on a plate. Thank you guys, thank you, thank you. Um, yep. Oh, uh, let's see. People that haven't met, this is my husband, Joe. Five minutes. Southern, uh, Hazel. You can see that. This is my husband, Joe. We have been married for 20 years. We both love cooking, and so we've learned to... I'm Joe. <laughs> what I mean, you say? Uh, I'm Joe? I'm Joe. I'm, I'm Marco. <laughs> You're so dumb. I'm not Joe. I'm Marco. Um, we both like cooking, and he likes doing more intricate like me uh, recipes, or like when he looks up... He, yes, my husband looks at the Better Homes and Garden. He likes to look at the different recipes, and he makes a phenomenal apple pie. Don't tell anybody that, okay? <laughs> so, anyways, he loves, and we both, uh, we found out we both like cooking and yeah, baking, and bad. we like being each other's side. Oh, get you now. What happened? The thing. Are we plugged the in, thing? baby? <gasps> no, we're not. What happened? This thing, it said low battery. Oh, okay. I How stopped low? it. I don't know. It stopped everything. Oh, shite. Oh yeah, look at we're still mm -hmm. there we go. <laughs> Sorry about that, y'all. Uh we found out that we both like cooking and we like being uh each other's assistant. How about that? Thank you. Um we we I don't know, we just like we like we like what was like cooking. 
Um, and because we both like cooking, we kind of assign each other like, hey, will you do this and this and I'll start doing this and this and it kind of works out great. Um, it looks like we have it prearranged, like what we're going to work on, but... <laughs> Steve's in. Mijo? Yeah. Hi, Mijo. My, bro my brother, my son, my nephew, my mom. Your niece. My whole family, my niece. No, no, there's no I'm, crying and cooking. Uh, you guys, I'm allowed to cry. No, 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 no. I, um, I've got some amazing merchandise. I've got, well, I mean, it's not even really like merchandise, but we yeah, wanted to. Um, it's merch. We wanted aprons for us so we can wear our stuff and... Um, I'm just excited that somebody's like, can I order one? I'm like, oh my God, you. You want to show them again what it's going to look like? You got to. Uh, yeah, does, is Dizzle in there? Or, yeah, go ahead and pull it up. Uh, oh, my phone. Well, I, I, do I have it on the iPad or no? No, she sent it to me. Oh. Wait, go to my face. Go to your Facebook. I got it, baby. You got it? You're going to go to my. Oh, mira que pasó. Okay. Sorry. You're all, you're all good. Ooh, yeah, baby. Hizzle. Hizzle. Oh, baby. Wow, you're just so slow, babe. You just said I'm slow? <laughs> no, I said this thing is oh. slow. Okay, coming, guys. Not coming it's up. coming yeah, up slow. There's our aprons. This is what we got coming in. Who that? Yeah, I thank you, Marissa. I, I, I know. There's an apron. Joe and I got one of those. That's we we wanted black instead of white because we're not the cleanest. And then there's t-shirts. We have t-shirts coming that we both ordered. Hoodies. What? Shut up, you guys. Shut up. Oh, oh, shut up, y'all. I wanted yeah. to cry, like yeah. my heart. We're going to have some other stuff, uh, hoodies by yep. uh, Jay Ware. Oh, yeah. We got we got hoodies by Jay Hey, Ware. Zero. Thank you for coming in. Thank you so much for coming in, girl. If you run into any pub and you see my daughter and she looks like this, tell her I said happy birthday. She, I don't know where she was going this weekend, but her birthday's this set, Sunday, so... You see my daughter out there. I think she was going, um, I don't know, somewhere in Europe. They want well, Some of her friends were going to take a train. It was kind of a surprise. Then, so, she's like, hey, Mom, I need spending money. They just bought my ticket. I'm like, what? Tell them they need to let you know beforehand. Who just spontaneously throws that on you? Okay, I got to get back to uh, reading my job. What so, guys. I'm putting my heat lower, and I'm going to grab my onions in. Yeah, it is all. It is. I think. My baby dizzle. My baby dizzle. Zero. All right, guys. Can you guys see? I'm going to zoom you in so you guys can see. Zero I took out birthday to Destiny. Thank you. Destiny. I'm taking out the last piece. Go ahead, baby. All right. And I got my fire low so that way my onions are not going to burn on this. All right. I'm going to check these. I'm going to take them right out just to get out of her way. Now I'm going to check these and then get you back to her for a minute. I think I'm going to put... And like I said, I need another five. We'll put them in another for... Oh, damn. Bottom, that is hot. Uh, put these in for another five. They're still... Nice and uh, firm. So let's go. Uh, hello. Stop cleaning. Five. Boom. Boom. Deuces. I just want the, all the juice to come out of this. Could you grab me another um, uh, real plate? Certainly. Thank you, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're awesome. Can you guys see my... Can you guys see the onions looking so precious? That look great. Go. You guys know that, or did I age myself by saying "go great"? Great. Mm -hmm. I think I want to put a little flour in it, baby, and then finish it with that. 
if I had my mushrooms, I would have taken these out, added flour to this, add my mushrooms to that. But because I did not, the, like I said, this is supposed to be a quick version that you put in your crock pot. That's why it goes with a can. But when I cook on the stove, I like to make my cream of chicken homemade. I like to make my cream of mushroom homemade. All right. Do you have um? What you need? A little bit of oil for my. Yes. Oh no no no, baby! I got some. I got you. Can you guys see my pan? Yep. Or, yep. 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 They're looking. I want a little bit of wet in there. Oh, a little bit of wet in there. Just so that it's not all dry. That's my main thing is I don't want a dry pan. What else do you need, babe? This. That? I'm putting about a half a tablespoon of flour. Hardly anything. Because I want, I, I'm, I really want to show you just a quick version. And the quick version is the quick version is the can, can soup. Just going to get my fire up to about <laughs> your, your brother told me not to burn my digits. <laughs> I know everybody keeps telling me, tell your family. Smell of vision would be great. Yeah, I know you guys. I'll scratch the screen. <laughs> I mean, these pans are making it smell phenomenal. Do you guys see what it looks like? Abby's all I'll, uh, Talking to everybody. Everyone, I know. click the like button. Mom, you yeah. just, you need to be on YouTube. <laughs> she's, on, she's not on it, man. Mom. Thank you, Abs. Everybody's like, tell your family to get their names off there. I said, I know, I know. I've tried, you guys. I've told everybody to hey, think Richard, of a superhero. Richard said he liked the new photo. Is he telling me the truth? Okay, or the, the new drawing, okay, of the car. Let me know if he's being truthful. Uh, my husband, uh, Southern, my husband is drawing for for my mom's uh, boyfriend. She, he's making a drawing for him that is of a car. You should show him the car. I can. It's right there. Where? Or your uh, photos. Oh, okay. Okay, guys, see that? It's dry because I put a little bit of flour. So it absorbed all of the oil that was in there. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of beef broth. Look at that. I am putting a little bit of cream because I am gonna put a can of cream of mushroom soup. don't want to um, put the cream you can do all just beef broth you guys you don't have to use the cream I just like to put a little bit of it in in gravies that I want like my cream of chicken soup my cream of mushroom I like it to actually have cream versus just uh, water or broth so remember guys after you put your flour you're gonna turn your heat up just a little bit because that's what's gonna thicken your your gravy right now the gravy is pretty much going on the little bit of flour i put but in a minute it, it doesn't look really look uh, liquidy but i'm going to put a can of cream of mushroom soup only half actually what's wrong <laughs> one one no Whisk, oh. if you use a whisk, it's going to dissolve what you have going in there versus a spoon will kind of just move it around, I guess I want to say. This whisk is going to break up what you put in there, whether it be water and flour or whatever. The, the, the thickness of it, or not the thickness, the lumpiness will go away based on your whisk. You guys see that? Woo! Don't touch the handle, anybody. 
<laughs> yeah. Got to be hot. Six. There you go. I don't really want, I don't, I'm going to taste it. I don't know if I want more beef broth or if I want just plain water because I want it to be broth. Yeah. But Let me get check uh, these. It. I'm going to need a little of this because that plate getting hot. Okay, shut her out of your face. Mmm, <laughs> that's so good. Ooh. I'm going to put Maybe. pepper in it. Maybe. Ooh, hey, I think they're done. I'm going to put salt. This salt, like, it doesn't really come out very much, so please, <laughs> it doesn't come out as strong as I would like it to be. They're just about, like, right there. Are they? Yeah. They're right there. They'll be done when we're ready. I'll do another three minutes. Okay. There we go. Back in the... I'm going to put my meat in. Can you guys see the consistency of it? I'm done messing with it now, guys. I'm not going to put any more liquid. This is exactly the consistency I wanted. I want to show you... Want me to get, zoom in? Um, we can go a little bit. Sure. All right. It's going to thicken, so that's why I don't want to do anything else to it. Oops. I'm going to grab my god my meat. I keep wanting to talk in Spanish. <laughs> I'm going to put two. Look at that. I zoomed in for you, baby doll. Thank you. Flip it over, move it around. If you have kids, cut these in half. That's They're kind of big. See that? You could. You don't have to keep them this size. Cut them in half. Make them uh, smaller. You know what I mean? This one is kind of big, so I need to get it in there. So I'm going to cut a piece of it off. You can cut it in that pan. You ain't got to worry about Teflon. Oh, right, right. Yeah. I'm gonna try the bay. I almost made scallop potatoes with this, but then I was like, no, kind of would rather not have that. Um, I don't know. I just want to do not. I want to do scalloped on a day that scalloped is gonna be great. All right, let me move this. How much time do yours have? Uh, my. Let me read the comments about this. Potatoes. Mm-hmm. Uh, looks like. Just a minute and a half left. Oh, that's so good. Okay. Oh, this isn't being used? It's not being used. All right, let me stick it in there so it doesn't get dumped. Whoop. Whoop. There's your mint mama. Hello. Oh, <laughs> thank you, guys. Holy moly. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you, Maddie. Much appreciated. Stop it, man. That's you're, awesome. You're man. in college, babe. Yeah, what is that? You know, don't be doing that. Oh, that's so I can send it to Mama's for her birthday. There you go. Thank you for. I'm gonna send it to Destiny. I'm gonna tell her Still. that you sent it along the way, babe. Okay, one from one college kid to another. Uh, I know that's a big sacrifice. That's harsh. That's that's big. That's big. My niece is going to a great college. My daughter's going to a great college, and I'm just blessed that they have go-getter attitudes. Gotta appreciate that, guys. All right, uh, we're gonna get the plate ready to be, to be like you guys know. We set up a plate so we can try it. Mmm, yeah, that's good. I don't know where to put this. Here you go. <laughs> you see what I did? I had a piece of meat. I'm like, I don't know where to put this. I threw it in the pot. I'm gonna clean up all the, all the um. I mean, I guess I could just get another freaking plate. How about that, Ivan? I hate... Hey, I do the dishes. I ain't getting no other plate. Ta-da! Plate? Plate, water, water, who the heat, water, heating. What, baby? I was just taking a while to load. It's okay. Yeah, it's all good. What, you're drawing? Yeah. Okay, we're going to get that plate of Papa's to get him done, baby. Yep. I'm heading that way. Um, do you want to show them this or you don't want to show them that? I'm going to show them this one first. Okay. I'm going to start setting up our plate. Okay. Right. San Antonio de Mexico, La Chihuahuas. 
That means, oh my gosh, that's so hot. All right, well. Oh. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> I'm I know I'm sleeping make you on the nervous. job. Make you nervous, huh? All right, it's all good. Okay. Well, my mother in law's boyfriend has a 1928 Ford Model A sedan, and he wanted me to uh, do a rendering for him. He said uh, I want to make it a kind of a hot rod. So I rendered this first one up, and it was a little too crazy for him. Then I'll show you the second one I came up with. That's so hot. Is it hot? <laughs> Well, my hands are yeah, so yeah. sensitive. I got you. Let me put a up a two, up a three. All right. What you doing? What I'm you just going to set two plates up. Oh, okay. Or do you want to just set one up? Just do one up for right now so you don't okay. get a mess around. Okay. We're well within our, our San time. Antonio de Mexico. Okay. I'm going to make the plate. What are you showing the pictures? I will. Go for it. All right. Here we go. This was the first one that he said it was a little too crazy for him with the blower on it and uh, stretched, lowered, and uh, chopped. So we did that. I did that one for him. Then uh, let me get the other one up here. So I am going to start with okay. I am going to use probably two pieces of butter because we like butter on our papa, potato. If y'all want to learn Spanish, the lady in the thing say, hey, how do you say this sentence or something? I can only know a few. My mom is the one that knows the more Spaniole. I'm just, I'm like an imitation. Oh, you know how imitation crab looks like it's crab, but then it's like <laughs> you really know that it's not because it says imitation crab. Okay, well, I'm Mexican, but then once I go into a Mexican restaurant, you know that I'm not because I'm going to try to have a conversation that's going to go nowhere. And we wanted, this is why we didn't want to do scallop because Joe wanted, he felt like a loaded potato. So I'm going to do, Show it's on the potato. You got it? Show them the plate that you're putting on there. It's okay. Cheese. Maybe the sour cream was supposed to go first. But when it was cheese, sour cream. Put a little more cheese on top after yeah, that. Yeah, I will. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> and a little butter. I already got you, baby. Oh, you already got it in there. And a little Scallion. bit of scallions. There's our loaded baked tater. Le loaded potatoes. Okay, I'm going to do the... Yeah, Thank you. You're very welcome. All right, let's... All right, she's going to put the meat on the table. The now, this is the more uh, subdued one that we ended up with. A little two-tone action, just a little hot rod stance. So, tell me what you think. All righty. <laughs> he likes people's positive criticism, anything, even negative. He likes to hear people's thoughts about yeah, it. Yeah, Absolutely. All right. Whoop. So, is. this is... A Salisbury steak with like an onion, well, basically a Salisbury sauce, and then a loaded potato. Very good. It looks right. great. Are we going to do the... We're going to do it. Ding. I need a soda pop. Soda. Come to mama. Oh, yeah. This is when we should be taking a picture. Yeah. Do your picture first. I know, right but now. I have that camera. Is there any... I wonder if I could take a picture. I don't know. Can one of you girls take a picture? <laughs> hold on. I gotta get back on my job here. I know. Hold on, hold on. Live chat. Okay. Maybe one of these buttons will do a live, do a picture taking. Huh. I don't know. Maybe not. Okay. Wait. There, take the picture now. Do you have a, a thing, babe? What do I need? Mm, maybe your camera will take a picture. Yeah. Hmm. Mine doesn't do as good as yours does, but... Yeah. But, there you go. Okay. That looks good. Ready? Not bad, not bad. You guys ready? We're going to try it! Hold on, hold on. Let me get back on the chat. There we go. Now I'm starting to be like you. Looks yummy. It looks delicious. Ready? Make a Venmo from Billy Jean. I have a Venmo. Do we have a Venmo? Uh, yeah, Southern, can you drop my Venmo that I sent you today? 
Thank you, guys. Thank you for all of the blessings. Big, small, any blessing, whether it be anything you guys anything. bless us with. Thank you, awesome. Nosy. If, if you're able to bless us with a cash app, thank you. If you're able to bless us with a gift from our wish list, thank you. If you're able just to do the like, thank you. If you can share it, any of it, all Absolutely. of it. Do that for me, baby. Absolutely. You got it. Okay. Dr. B, better than Dr. Pepper. Yeah, it really is. We were shocked when we found out that it was. I always say that. <laughs> oh, it is. It's true. Okay, let's do it. I need a fork. It's right here, Danny. Oh, yeah. I get one of those. Okay. All right. Ready? Onion. I got to have onion. Whoop. Nervous. I'm having a rough time. There we go. <laughs> okay. There we go. Hey, baby. Tink, tink. Mm -mm. Oh, pretty good. It's tender. The gravy made it good because it was made in that mm -hmm. pan. That was good. I mean, literally, I put no... Stuff's I mean, tender. You don't have to, like, cook the crap out mm -mm. of it for a long time. That cute I would say, steak is If you're going to get a beef broth, I would say the small can of beef broth would be enough for you for that much gravy. You mm -hmm. don't need much of it because the pan has all the remnants of when you cooked it. With all the parts that fell off of the, the beef uh, patty. So don't feel like you have to add something like that. You ready to do the baked potato? Yeah, let's do a loaded tater here. Here we go. Loaded baked potato. Tink. Mm. That's always good. I know what you're going to say. What? It needs bacon. Oh, mm. oh, oh, it needs bacon so bad. Bacon is like... Don't get me wrong. That's really good. Bacon is like I flavored, love my potatoes. flavored salt. Like, but that's good. But bacon's better. Yeah, it's good. Mm. Mm. Any questions? <laughs> Any questions? <laughs> Why? This is mm -hmm. <laughs> this is your brain on loaded baked potatoes. Any questions? I have um, a Venmo. It is. <laughs> Hold on. That's good. That's really good. Southern, were you camper. able to? I'm a happy camper. Southern Charm, were you able to drop the Venmo at all or not? Are you busy? Um, it's on that phone. Oh, oh no. Having problems there, Kitty? Um, no, it's okay. We'll have to put it on the next one, y'all. Don't worry about it. I'll put it on the next one. Um, I'm trying to think of other stuff that was, um, if you want to do this in the, if you want to do, uh, this in the slow cooker, you don't even have to fry it in a pan. Open your slow cooker, throw your two pieces of meat or one meat on the bottom. I onions, a layer of onions first. Onions on the bottom. Yeah. Do your meat. It doesn't even have to be seized, uh, bla uh, toasted or whatever. The, no. Uh, you can just put your meat it's in the slow cooker. Toasted, though. I love that. You can do your slow cooker. Sorry, here, put it right. higher. Do your slow cooker. All right, put some onions on the bottom. Dice up onions, put it in the bottom. You don't even have to just dice it. You don't even have to put it in slices. Um, then put your meat. Put that can of uh, cream of mushroom. Yep. And then onion. And then onions. Meat. And then meat again. Just layer it two just or three layer. times. Oh, yeah. For as many meats you're going to have. Yeah. Put the top on the slow cooker. Give it on low. I think I did it for five hours. Yeah, something like Then that. you come back later and your meat. Pulling it out with your tongs, it usually because it's seasoned it's, or uh, treated, it went through a machine. It did, it does fall apart if oh, you're gonna yeah, put it in a slow cooker. I mean, it's it's fall apart. This is you, more of like, like a um, this is more a like a steak. steak. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but yeah, but it's it's not like chewy or you know. No, it's it's not definitely at all. It's, not. it's just nice and meaty, you know. Yeah, it's firm and and uh, delicious. <laughs> <laughs> That's so extra. <laughs> Okay, mm -hmm. we're done, guys. We are done. Baked potato, loaded baked potato, Salisbury steak. Thank you for joining us on a Friday oh, yeah. night. Anybody oh, yeah. saying stuff? They're going, hey. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> hey, hey, stop. <laughs> What's going on? All right. Love mm -hmm. y'all. This all, thank you. She's got our shirts. Drop in the chat. Thank you, Jilly Bean, for making this. Uh, Southern, well, Southern Charm can drop her 
my Venmo into, um, or my, yeah, the Venmo into our group chat group. Thank you guys, everybody coming in. You guys are amazing. Thank you. If you guys could hit the like she on your way out. out. Um, everybody grateful Southern, everybody. What? Hey. <laughs> um, yes, that's Joe's uh, Venmo. It's not my name. It's going to be his name. But yeah, it is. We have two. I have the Cash App and PayPal, and he has the Venmo. He does, he does sharpening knives, so that's why he has his own clients. Thank you, guys, Zero. I totally appreciate you taking the time. All my mods, thank you for being here, dropping all the information. My family, you guys are so kind. I appreciate it. Um, I think that's it for a Friday night. Y'all enjoy your Friday night. Thank you again. I'm beyond blessed to have you guys give me a shot. That's the main thing. I appreciate you guys giving me a chance on my food, on our food. Um, homemade macaroni and cheese is tomorrow. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. We'll get some bacon for tomorrow. On top of your macaroni and cheese? Yeah. So we'll do a homemade uh, macaroni and cheese tomorrow night. And then if you guys want to give us plans for the coming week, we'd love them. Anything, anything. We're open to anything. Even if you want to see it and we haven't made it, you've heard about it, I literally will take on pretty much any recipe. But... Should, should show them the girls before we go. You want to get on camera? Okay, hold on, you guys. Oh, Be prepared to fall in love. Come here, guys. Come here. Over here. Are you going to set them? Yeah, just set them. Come here. You guys are going to fall in sit. love. Yeah, I mean, I know you guys sit. have seen them already. Sit on love. Are they going to sit together? Right there. Or? Right there. Stay. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Who's that? Is that their tail? <laughs> <Yeah>. Good Lord. <laughs> Can you say hi, baby? Novi? Oh, what a beautiful girl. You smell all that That's, meat. This is Bailey. She's our needy one. She's our just our protector. Yeah, she's she's a good good protector. They both this is our lap dog. She's a lover. Don't believe what you hear about pit bulls, please. Lughead. Don't Look believe what you hear about them. Give them a chance. They're nothing like what they say. That's a good girl. Yes, you are. If you're kind to your doggy, they love it and they are kind back to you. Yes, that's a good girl. That's a good girl. <laughs> oh, she saved my wife's face. <laughs> <laughs> That's not even Oops. funny. She's so, she's so sweet and kind. Joe, you're horrible. All right, guys. You guys are right. fabulous. Thank you guys for, for being here. And you know what? I know some people asked what was our, um, our, our, our uh, Valentine's Day. We didn't have to do one in the evening. We didn't do it to go and declare, defend, or do anything. Um, I've seen some pretty stupid comments about, I can't believe she wasted a Valentine's Day going live. It's like, I wanted to express my thank you for my pans. And since I went live for that, I decided to say something. I went live to let my ladies know I appreciated whoever got me the pans. All the ladies, I wanted them. I didn't want to open it privately. I wanted to say thank you, guys. Absolutely. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And every day is Valentine's Day for us. Yeah, you're Girl, right, Chris Southern. Do, man. We love, we love, you know what? We love uh, hanging out with y'all. Y'all have become an extended family for us. He hears all of the names, and then you guys get to I'm actually so meet confused. him. I know my daughter goes, Mom, you live in an avatar. Like, you have a Snow White and a southern charm and a nosy and and she goes i said something about one of my other girlfriends who has a, just a regular name like marissa or uh, even jilly bean she's like jelly bean i was like no her name is jilly bean and she's like the only one of that whole group is two these two names and i i, I think it's funny i think grateful is super nice i think everybody has got their own personality when i go into their chats i love talking to them so when i kind of catch him up on my on how funny something was. Just smile and nod. He does. So he's like, oh, really? And then you guys actually come in here, and then he gets to me. I love Hermit. I'm My nephew and niece to, to this day call you Kermit instead of Hermit. <laughs> but I it's, I don't know what people have experiences on YouTube, but um, for us, YouTube. we have positive uh, we have positive, positive experiences. Yeah. Our nieces and nephew enjoy it. We laugh with them, and... I'm, I'm not going to let good any times. of the good times. good times, good times, good times for sure. Um, I'm not going to let anybody that wants to not have a good time. 
I don't have time for them. We have a good time. My niece and nephew cooked with us. We had a good time. People that come in our chat have a good time. I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. Now we're going to have a good time and we're going to eat. Oh, we're going to eat. All right. Have a blessed day. Carrie, I love you. Thank you for coming in, girl. Watch the replay. Love you guys. Have a blessed day. Blessed Bye. night. I'm sorry. Have a great weekend. If anybody doesn't come in, oh, her, his name is Otis the Bear. No. Oh, and her dog, her pit bull is 12 years old. Aww. We have never, everybody That's tells good. us they don't That's last. So you. you just blessed my <laughs> heart to tell me that great news. <laughs> for Nova. I know, it was great, great good news. news. For Nova. Thank you. If you guys don't come in back in until Monday, enjoy your weekend, everybody. Have a blessed weekend. Remember, yeah, absolutely. we were given an extra day. We'll probably be back tomorrow, so. We will. Okay. But you were given an extra day that some people weren't is given. Okay? So make the best of it. <laughs> Shut up. Is that, um, uh, yeah, just make the best of your day. Smile at somebody. You don't know how long it's been since somebody smiled at them. You could change the day of their whole freaking week. I mean, just. It's deep. It's not that deep. <laughs> I love everybody. I'm serious. So, Southern, <laughs> I've talked to you about it. Just, I like being happy. You know, there was a, a before even, and then I it, it, I made a growth, and I, I decided that I'd love, I'd rather spread love than be mean to people. So I like that I care about people's feelings. So. Yeah. Oh, kitten, a mama. Love you, kitten, a mama. Mom, love you love kitten. somebody's kitten or you want a kitten, mom? What? She did not respect it. Bye, you guys. <laughs> what was bye, that? Bye, Dizzle. Bye, Carrie. Love you guys. Mom, love you. I'll talk to you later. My brother, my son, everybody, thank you. And now my little nephew, or my grandson. You guys. My little. The Felipe. girls say goodbye. The girls say bye bye. They said bye-bye. Oh, she's drooling everywhere. I know. Bye. You that one there? Say no, bye-bye. There's one over there. Right there. Oh, she's stretching. That means she's excited. Yeah. Bye, guys. See y'all. Bye, Southern Girl. Thank you. Bye, Dizzle. Thank you so much. Guys, check out Dizzle's website. We got shirts and hoodies. She's got amazing t-shirts, too. Super great color. Like, I love one. Do all that stuff. I wore one the other day that says, I'm the... I'm the... I'm the girl that what re what does my shirt say? I'm the girl that listens to I a gangster rap on the way to the farmers market. Listen, yeah. I got that from Dizzle's. Uh, she's got her own store, oh, or ooh, her own business. I know. So check out her shirts; they're really cool. It's a nice army green color. I got another one just recently that um, they got Jesus ones and uh, be yeah. still. A few more days, we'll have our our, our aprons. Ah! I'm gonna have my apron. See what they look like. Uh, I'm excited. Modeling. Oh, Lord. We'll be eye candy in it all. <laughs> Have a good day. Bye, guys. Video. Bye, Mom.